hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to warp images here in adobe express let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in adobe express i want you to click the sign up option and from here just to follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Adobe Express does not currently support image warping, distorting, or bending an image into shapes like arcs, waves, or custom forms directly. But of course, we are going to try to achieve similar effects or use alternative approaches within the Adobe's ecosystem. Okay? So, once you are logged into your account, I want you to go to the uh, project or design that you're working. If you haven't already, just go to the template section we're in. You can try to browse templates. And get inspired from these amazing designs if you want to upload your own content and start from scratch just click this button now first of all what i'm going to do is cup i'm going to use this specific element that i've been working all right i'm going to click add same size and add this one right here so i'm going to warp this into a circular maybe um, a media let's go for the shape now i'm going to Go into the elements instead. Say, for example, I'm going to warp it inside the uh, maybe um, circle. Okay. Now, first thing is go to the image and try to click on the remove background so that we can isolate the photo of the image right here and try to warp it inside the uh, circle thing. All right. You have to drag it all the way here. All right, maybe we're going to put it on the back, set, bring to front, all right? Although it doesn't have the warp effect, what you can do here is kind of let like use of the cropping method for your image, all right? So because, again, your option is quite limited, all right? So uh, you can do that. Try to squeeze in all the image as much as you can without sacrificing the uh, proportions, all right? So that's one way for you to be able to do it. Now, on the uh, circle, you might want to choose something like resembles the color of your photo. So it blends perfectly well, all right? So we're going to choose more color. Maybe this, you see that? So you can play around. So we're going to choose more colors here. Maybe go for the custom. Let's go something like grayish bit of color you see that so at least you're trying to hide the image here it's not visibly uh, broken all right so that's one way for you to be able to warp images here in adobe express and of course what the next thing that you can do is go to the download section all right you can download it as a png wherein once you have downloaded that you might want to export this amazing design that you have created here and export it to advanced tools like adobe illustrator and adobe photoshop all right so i'm going to do that all right download this one right here to show you how we can do it in photoshop matter of fact you don't have to go to the uh, adobe photoshop application instead but I, what i want you to do is go to the upper right corner where you can see these squares icon you have the web apps and services all they're gonna do is click the adobe photoshop express it's an online apps all right if you click on it you would be forwarded here wait for it to load okay and from here you can start your free trial and try to work as the image to warp it based on your preferences all right and that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next one